Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome to the Sweet Stuff Going Mobile. This week I'm going to begin part one of a two-part series on 10 free productivity applications for your iPhone. I've picked them based on the wide range of things that they can help you accomplish to make you more productive. So we'll cover five this week and five next week. Let's get started. First up is Recall. Recall is a cool tool for your iPhone. Makes it easy to remember things. You can have items that you've added. You can go back. You can tap the plus. You can add messages and tasks to your list with voice or with text. If you do it with voice, it converts it into text for you. Done. Just tap done. It's also available for BlackBerry and Android. And you can access your things from a web account. Up next is Skype. Skype is just a handy, cool tool available for Windows, Mac, and Linux. Also available on BlackBerry, Android. You can go into your contacts, look at your settings. You can look at your information, change your profile, look at your history, make a call, and lots, lots more. Extremely handy to have on your iPhone. Up next is Dropbox. Dropbox is gaining in popularity. It's available for Windows, Mac, Linux, Android, BlackBerry, and iPhone. The things you put in your Dropbox appear in all copies of Dropbox, wherever they may be. You can go in here and change the setting. Go back. You can also tap Favorites if you have any, and you can access your Dropbox. So it's extremely handy for sharing pictures and documents. Your account is free up to two gigabytes. And I've noticed that there are a number of free utilities that are making Dropbox even more handy. Up next is Evernote. To me, you have to have Evernote. It's a free form database, lets you store a wide range of information, text, images, video, audio, and lots more. I'll sign into my account. And you see here, it's reminding you, you can remember everything. You can access all the things that are already in your Evernote database, which you can access from your desktop, also from your browser. And then you can also add things by text, snapshot from your camera roll, and you can use voice messages. And it will sync and keep all of your notes and things in your database up to date. Very slick. And last up is Vlingo. Lingo is very cool. It's also available for Android and BlackBerry, except the terms. What can you say? You can do text messages with your voice. You can send email. You can find things on the map. You can update your Facebook and Twitter accounts. You can dial and do web searches. So Lingo will go through and it learns all of your contacts names. There's a quick introduction on how to use Lingo. You just press it and speak and good things happen. So, those have been five of my ten free productivity apps for the iPhone. That's all for me for this week. I'll be back next week with the last five. I certainly hope you'll join me. And until then, for all the sweet stuff, stay right here on Butterscotch.com. Hey, this is Doc. I know a lot of you watch my show, so if you'd like to show your support, Head on over to hover.com slash sweet stuff and get domains for 10% off. You show your support. Hover is easy to use and lets you get domain names and make the most out of them. Thanks.